my 360, which is my span and double my height. One span is one height, and the uh, they were made by painting simultaneously with both my hands. Um, yeah, after a long process of paintings, I started using my hands more, and then I realised I could achieve uh, symmetry, and and then started making these, which were a kind of record of the event of their making, as well as yeah. Um, session so um, you know it's quite quick drying acrylic paint and it was necessary to make the whole piece before uh, I didn't allow myself to paint wet paint on dry you know so so it was kind of like being in a not exactly a trance like state but certainly in the kind of zone but the, but curiously some of the early marks kind of generate a kind of character or kind of lead one for work paintings that I've made over the last three or four years. Um, they grew initially out of a series that I called self-portraits, which were uh, paintings black or white of a capitalised letter I, the word we have in English for ourselves that we share with everyone else. And to begin with, they were uh, strict reproductions of, of names. I've been concerned a lot with identity, but also with illusion and mirroring, and, and there is, you know, a kind of left-right mirroring within the images here, and then there's a series known as mirror paintings, three of which are in the show, um, in which the surface itself suggests those meeting of marks on the surface could be met by something beyond, if you like. This is, um, and then there are the action paintings, which are a, a record again of an event, but they're kind of very swift paintings, wet painting, wet, silver and black, and, and they yeah, are kind of arrested at a certain... <laughs> In 2007 when I started on the self-portrait series and yeah, they, they've always been black on white from that point. Um, I think, you know, probably the, the, the mirror paintings were the kind of the end of this kind of body of work, so I don't know where, where next we're painting. Colour might come in, yeah. <laughs> 